Welcome back to the season finale of The Walking Dead Season 2, and we are about to change Kenny's old crusty eye socket whole thing. We're about to change his bandages, so thank you so much for returning to Episode 2. Let me know in the comments if you're excited to see what happens next, and without further ado, let's do this. Let's change the bandage. Oh, it's gonna be gross. Oh, what's it look like? So how's it look? Um, Still gonna be pretty when this heals. I'm glad Carver's dead. We saw to that, didn't we? It looks um. Well, it doesn't look like a gaping hole. It looks like just a uh, a huge pussy mess. That's all it really looks like. This is gonna sting like the Dickens, Kenny. So I'm sorry. But it has so, to be done. I'm guessing this is going to be the shitty part. So this is going to hurt like hell. Well, you could have lied a little, you know. Nope. Can't do that. Let's do this. Let's get it over with. <sighs> Holy fucking hell. <sighs> you need to stop squirming. Yeah. Come on, come on. Yeah. And we, okay. we have to clean that too. You're like, right. make sure you get all the blood out. Let's go. Come on, Kenny. You can do this. <sighs> Sorry about the language, Junior. You're gonna be tougher than me when you're grown. I'm gonna expect you to be more of a gentleman than I am. But man, does that smart? He'll be tough, just like his dad. Oh, Alvin didn't look it, but yeah, that guy had a pair. You were right about me giving myself up. I can't believe I was willing to sacrifice Alvin just to hold out a little longer. We should have saved him sooner. Got him out of the camp. I'm gonna think about that every time I look at Alvin Jr. here. Don't think about the bad things. Think about what you can Alvin do to make up for them. should be here. Raising this boy. It should be him, not me. The best thing you can do for Alvin and Rebecca is raise him right. Make sure he's safe. I intend to. Good. Just stop acting like a, a downer and start being happy. Alright. Now, Kenny... If Kenny became the governor... No, no I'm just kidding, but that'd be, that would be interesting if he did. I mean, he does have an eye patch. Well done. But it wouldn't make sense at all yep. in the comic book wise. Are you ready to go? Let's head out. Okay. Moving on out. Get into the food, get into the camp. Maybe, maybe that, that that kid, the Russian-speaking kid, hopefully he won't betray us for the freaking fifth time in a row. If he does, I'm putting a bullet in his head. Uh, without a doubt, 100% putting a bullet through his face. I'm surprised we have not seen any walkers yet. That's a godsend. Is that it? Hey, I'm talking to you! What? It? It's what? What do you mean, what? The place you're fucking taking us! Arvo, is this where the supplies are? Where the food is? Answer her, goddammit! Come no, on, it's Kenny. at the house. There's still more work. Some more hours. God damn it. Oh, I knew gosh. this was <laughs> This guy fucked us. Uh, thank you. Don't mention it. It's getting dark. Maybe we should stop for the night. This is bullshit. Relax. Don't tell me to relax. He's lying. He's been lying this whole time. You don't fucking know that. I think we should spend the night here, if it's safe. That's a big if. Well, there's a fence, which would help with walkers. Maybe. It'll be alright. Can we just try and have a calm, quiet night? Please. That sounds nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it does. Oh, shit. Sorry about that. It's alright, buddy. It's alright. If we're staying, we should scout this place out. True. Right. 
Try no to find some. Here. We need baby I'll formula sure for the kid. Without that, the kid's gonna die. I'll no offense, he should have been dead already. <laughs> uh, see if, uh, see if you can calm him down a bit. Because the baby needs, um, it needs no, breast milk at least, like, or at least bottled milk. I don't know. <laughs> Stick out your tongue. Wouldn't have guessed that it work. Me neither. I think he likes you. Calmed right down for you. He's cute. Yeah, he is, isn't he? Most babies are pretty ugly this soon after being born. That's yeah, true. they are. They usually look like weird little aliens. <laughs> Here, I got them. Come on over. It's safe. <clears throat> Well, the first two years with the baby is going to be the toughest because that's when their bones start to grow and their teeth start to come in and they need like a strict diet. So, yeah, it's um, it's going to be difficult, but around like toddler years, it gets better. They're more manageable. Today's my birthday. Happy birthday. Here as I can tell, at least. Happy birthday, Luke. Yeah, man. Happy birthday. Thanks. So, that makes you... What? 27? That's... That's right. I'm surprised you remember. Sure as hell feel a lot older. Don't even start with that shit. <laughs> Got out of college five years ago. Feels like a million years. At least I don't have to worry about paying off them student loans. I hear that. I'm sure there's some asshole sitting on that paperwork. Waiting to collect. I hope I can go someday. Maybe when this is all over. I hope so too, Clem. I don't know. Just a waste of money. Well, the major in art history hasn't helped too much the last few years. Hey, <laughs> art history, like that's um, working in a coffee shop. Pretty good. Pretty much. Oh, stop it. You get a minor in agriculture. Keep the old man happy. Oh, I almost forgot. We're saving it for a special occasion, man. All it being your birthday and all. Heck, Figure. yes. This is as good a time as any. Uh, is that a good idea? No, no, no. Let's take a sip. I mean, after you, obviously. Really? No. Oh, what's a sip? Come on. Her? You are not drinking. That is that. Just a sip. Just a you wee a bit of a sip. The first Whoa, wait. Just a wee bit. You gotta make a toast. I'm not really the, uh... Come on, birthday boy. It don't have to be fancy. A toast means we all got something to drink. Oh, we can just pass the bottle around afterwards. Go on. <clears throat> to the loved ones that we've lost along the way. And to the hope that we see them again. Someday. Here, here. That was real nice. Yeah? I didn't mean for it to rhyme. That was... Well... I got first watch. <laughs> I think the fence has got us pretty secure. Can't be too careful. The baby might be cold. Come on, Kenny. Just sit a little while longer. Nah, you stay warm. Clem, let him go. I'm gonna post up over near the hole in the fence there. Holler if you need anything. And you're taking Thanks, the baby Kenny. with you, right? You're taking him into the cold. When he should be near the fire. Just saying. <laughs> Fire's real nice. Plenty of room if you want to get warm. Maybe in a bit. I didn't expect her to come back. Just when I thought I got her figured out, she up and surprises. It's a good thing. You saved our ass. We're lucky to have yeah, her. Yes, she did. I'm glad she's here. She's, well, she she's one of my favorite back. characters. So that puts her as okay in my book. Well, it ain't no secret how you feel about it. Oh, come on. I'm just teasing. It was stupid. I understand. She's a pretty girl. Once you get past all the dirt and guts. I don't know. I guess I just wanted to forget about all this shit for like ten minutes. Ten minutes? Man, that's longer than I'd last at this point. Hey. <laughs> all, right. all right, it wasn't ten minutes. Come on. We got a little one around. Sorry. 
That's gross. Yeah, that's she talk like that. I know what you're talking. I know it's what you're talking for about. It up. I know what you guys are talking about. I certainly hope not. You're talking about kissing stuff. <laughs> yep. Uh, yeah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yes. That. That is exactly it. Was there any kissing? You shut your mouth right now, the both of you. Maybe she came back for you. Could be. Nah. I don't know what to say to that. I'd come back for you. You know what I mean. <laughs> well, thank you, Clay. We friends. We homies. We watch each other's backs. Hey, shut up. Don't be modest. Your moves are working on all the legs. Worked on me. Ooh, that means they, she likes him. Oh, shit. I just did it too, didn't I? Sorry. It's the drink talking. They say a drunk I, I would man like if, a sober man if Luke and, and her got well, together. I ain't a man. I, so I, I'm sensing sparks. Clem, go see if you can get Jane and Kenny over by the fire. It's too cold. First, give me a sip of that liquor, woman. Oh, and here. Maybe a swig of this will change the minds. A swig. I'm gonna take a drink. Well, what was this? Oh, look at sign. Alright. At least we don't need to worry about being electrocuted. I wonder if we could get in there. That would be a lot better. Look at Transformer. Transformers? I TV. Feels like forever since we had electricity. Go to a dam. That's like the best place you can go to is a dam. Because um, electricity powered by uh, by the water running through it. They expect you to lure me over there with alcohol? I wouldn't have expected a bottle to last this long. Will it work? That depends. What is it? It's bourbon it's 69. Rum? Oh, rum. Probably. That would be hilarious if on the bottle it was a picture of, of Lee. <laughs> and Lee's family was like the heir to, a, to the rum fortune or something like that. I don't know. It, it might be awkward. I wasn't expecting to. We're all adults. You know. If you make it weird because be you around. made it with Luke. It doesn't have to be. We're all adults here. Are we now? You know what I mean. Mature or whatever. I wish it was that easy. It is. People just love making it harder than it has to be. Why does this feel like I'm signing a contract or something? <laughs> You're sending your soul off. That's really good. Hey, I, I wouldn't even drink that much, but it's okay. Yes, um, I would. I would sure. take a sip or two. It's a privilege. <laughs> you okay? Come, Kenny. Uh -oh, busted. Oh I my gosh, dude. I wasn't too much older than you when I had my first drink. God, I was so stupid back then. There was this time I broke into my parents' liquor cabinet and drank a whole bottle of this really spicy, sweet liquor. Oh, what was its name? It was dumb. Earthquake or something. Sounds like you were a bad kid. I guess I was. At the bottom of the bottle, there were these sugar crystals, and I got it in my head that I really wanted to eat a couple. So I got the bright idea to smash it on my parents' dining room floor to get at them. And it shattered into a thousand pieces all over the dining room. Wow, that's <laughs> really stupid. Yeah, Clem, I was drunk. The problem with glass is it looks a lot like sugar crystals. That's Ooh. never really been a problem for me. That hurts. Keep it that way. My sister found me, drunk, blood pouring out of my mouth. Jamie thought I was dying, so she called 911. They pumped my stomach. Got grounded for six months. You ate glass? I ate glass. I haven't thought about that in a long time. I 
guess a deal's a deal. Everyone yeah. should take at least one or two sips, and then give the bottle back to Luke. That guy and when it's about almost anyways. halfway, save it for another time. That's what I would do, just to preserve the taste. Time to not make it weird. All right, let's go to Kenny. Talk to him. Make him not be so mad after I just got a drink. Want to sit here? No, that's. I'm fine. Oh yeah. Okay. Wherever you like. Thank you. All right. Now we're all near the fire. Kenny, what is that? Arvo. Oh. We can talk to Arvo. I'm gonna go over to Kenny first, though. Kenny, you want a swig? No. Can I talk to you at least? There, there, little guy. Shh. Shh, I got you. I got you. Hey. Oh, hey, Clem. I asked you not to drink. Girl your age, it ain't right. Sorry about that. You're not I know my dad. You think you're older, but. Sorry about that. I didn't mean to disappoint you. You're not, hun. It's probably not my place to be telling you what to do. It's a nice night. Just, uh, needed some air. Kenny, there's air everywhere. He's just depressed. I'm sorry for, for how I acted back there. After Sarita was... I just... I, I couldn't handle it. I'm sorry. I mean, you did what you could. You tried to help, and I blame. I could have done it. more. You really hurt me. I'm nothing so, so to sorry. apologize for. You don't have anything to apologize for. I know you didn't mean it. Thanks. I miss my boy. I miss him so much. I didn't raise him like I should have. Made mistakes. Wasn't there a whole lot for a couple years. Off on a boat somewhere or other. I thought I enjoyed that time away from him, from my family. But I'd give anything for one more second with them. To play catch with Duck. To touch Koch's face. I miss Duck too. He was a good friend. And I haven't had too many of them. He was a good boy. Pure. He was a good kid, but at the same happy. time he That's got into a lot of trouble. Like thrown into a world like this it's gonna be different with him he's gonna get raised right I won't make the same mistakes again that's a promise you should get back over by the fire what about you you have a baby dude There's no sense in both of us being over here I can handle watch on my own you should come too I don't know Come on. Come on. It'll be good for everyone. We're all gonna get drunk. And yeah, okay. Yeah, getting drunk, eating s'mores, telling ghost stories, and then we'll all get ambushed by walkers and die because we were drunk. <laughs> yeah. All right. Kenny, our awesome sister, who's who's badass, is over there. <laughs> uh, I was gonna go talk to Arvo. Jane. But I guess not. You don't have to justify that with a response. Hey. I find it's best to just get this stuff out in the open. Less drama. Well, that's fine. But I can confirm there was no time for kissing. <laughs> All right, enough of that. Now that Clementine's back, we have hey, to go to G-rated mode. It's nice to hear people laughing. Yeah, it is. You just spend so much time trying to stay alive that you don't get a chance to enjoy living. Yeah. We need to make more time for that. Alcohol helps. <laughs> Hell yeah. It yes, it does. It helps a little bit. I don't know. 
Alcohol's not for everybody. Let me get that bottle. We got someone else that might need some help. He's in the cold. Sounds like a waste of good rum. He lost his sister today. And whose fault was that? That makes it even harder to deal with. Trust me. He needs it as much as anyone right now. It's a nice thing to do. I said my piece. Kenny needs to realize that even though people do bad things, we need to be the better people matters. than them. I just think treat them with more kindness than they treated things. us. So it shows them do it a lot the error of their ways. The world being what it is. Now you know more. <laughs> The so more you know. Leave me alone! Okay. Sorry, okay? My fault. I shouldn't have. Leave me alone! Arvo, you, you know that we're in a world of zombies and they're attracted by sound, so yelling isn't the best thing. And all he needed to say was Please no. It. It's okay. It's okay. She's in a better place. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Maybe it's best if we all get some rest. Who knows how long a walk we got tomorrow. Yeah, that's a good idea. I'll take first watch. Again. Thank you, Kenny. <laughs> I'll take first really? watch. I'll take first watch. <laughs> I, uh... Don't mention it. You did good. It was nice while it lasted. All right, well, I guess this episode is mostly just around the campfire and uh, recuperating after all of the gun battles and eye patcher uppers from episode one. I have a feeling there might be something more to this episode. I, I know because this got a pretty good score. Um, I don't I don't think it's just going to be getting to a place and then ending it. There's something has to happen. It's the Walking Dead. Nothing ever ends up good. You sure you're good? Yeah, yeah, I'm good. If I if I start to crap out, I'll let you know. Okay, will you do that? It's no trouble. How much further? Close, very close. You've been saying that every time I ask. Please. Come. Ooh, behind I'm really behind starting to think. think. <gasps> you're full of shit. It can't be much further. Behind you! What the fuck? Ah, ah, Jesus Christ! Ooh. Oh no, the baby. Oh no, the baby. That was close. Fucker came out of nowhere! That was real loud. Hopefully there aren't more of them. Yeah, well, let's move. We don't want to be around to find out. It's very close. Come. That's how Lee got bit last time. I hope Kennedy didn't get the bit. That that would have sucked. There. That piece of shit? It's half built. It's shelter. We're here for the supplies, not the house. It's warm. Fireplace. Very warm. It looks like it's empty. Yes. It's empty. I thought it so too. Better be. But now that he said that, I'm not as sure. If it ain't, kid's gonna wish it was. We should send at least. Are we just gonna walk over? Two people to go check it out. No, don't walk Maybe over. Maybe there's the a ice. way around. What? I don't see any. Say it in an American asshole. It's okay. Walk. Ice. No shit, ice. That's the problem. He's saying it's fine. If we just go real slow, go slow. it'll probably be like okay. Slow. <laughs> yeah, no need to rush this. We need to spread out, just to be safe. Less weight, the better. Let the Rusky go first, since he's so confident. It's okay. I'd say just walk on the parts that you think have the most thickest ice. All right, everybody's. Let's walk on this ice very slowly. Very slowly. Don't 
Don't crack. We can do this. Don't crack. Halfway there. Oh. We're okay. Don't, Don't worry. Move. Oh. Oh no. We got some walkers behind us. That's only a few of them. Should be all right. Let's yeah, just get but to we're the walking house. and they'll crack. The... Hey. Just run, guys. Just run. Fuck. That's two less to deal with. I'll just stay spread out and we'll be fine. Hey. You mother sucker. Shit. He's gonna kill him. <gasps> Kenny. Get back here, you piece of shit. Don't run to the baby. They're over. Alright, go. You have walkers coming up behind you. Oh, Luke. Oh, no. Don't come over here. Hey, I can make it. It's, it's fine. You sure? Yeah. You got walkers on the way. Let me help you. Too thin for both of us. I just, I just gotta be careful. Oh, no, no. And yeah, he's Stop. in. Stop. I'm fine. I'm fine. No, you're not. You need help, Luke. The ice is too thin. I got it. You need right, to help. Come on. No. Clem, go. Go help no, him. No, Clem, do not. Just go back for him. You're light. You Stop can do it. Stop telling her that. Clem, look at me. Pull out your gun. And shoot those damn walkers, okay? If we Just do that, then more's gonna come. I'm going to Clem, come freaking help you. But you need to go. Kenny Clementine, needed. Clementine! Everyone, stop telling me what to do. Okay, they're shooting the walkers anyways. Just go back. Please. We got you. Please. It's gonna be alright. Mo. It's cold, it's so cold. Cold, it's cold, it's cold. Shoot, shoot your gun. No way. Water walker, water walker. Get away, get away, get away. Oh shoot, underwater assassination, Kenny. That did not just happen. Oh, fuck, fuck. It's okay, I got you. No. I got you. Come on, come on. Come on, you're gonna be okay. Go to the house. We need a fire. Oh, fuck, she's gonna fucking freeze to death. Really, people? Luke, really? He has to come back. He has to come back. I don't believe he's dead. There's no way. Nah. He's gonna come back. I have faith. How the fuck did that happen? There's a fireplace. Jesus Christ. We have to get her warm. She's gonna freeze to death. Give her your jacket. Arvo, if you look at me like that one more time, I'm gonna smack the crap out of you. This is all your fault. You should have gone away. God damn it. I tried to help him. I just I said I started to go. There was nothing any of us could do. Clem tried to help him. He just Oh god. You son of a bitch! This is your fucking fault! Kenny! Don't, no, man! To what? It's nobody's damn fault! I'm freezing. Can we just get a fire started? Kenny, more important things at hand here. Look at this place. Just a stack of fucking toothpicks. Bet those magical supplies are bullshit too. 
What? No speaking of English? Fuck you. You fucking commie piece of shit! Teddy! Fuck you. You fucker! Fuck what the uh, fuck, Ken? Doing too much, dude. Just stop. What? Lose your taste for this sort of thing? There's another just like it. He wasn't lying. You want to tell me how a can of fucking chili is going to help How is beating a kid to death going to help anyone? This is your fault, and you damn well know it. It's all of our faults. We all need to just shut up, give me a dang fire, and then we'll find food I'm later. Tying him up. Fine. Jeez, Mike, it's not. Help me get a fire started. You okay? Well, never mind. It, it, it's, it's hurt hard. real bad. Mike. Huh. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh. You got a light? I was gonna kill Kenny. I really tried. I, I, I can see. I can see it in his eyes. Everyone get the hot dogs. We'll make some some hamburgers. Oh man! All right, everyone, just take a breath. Take a flipping breath. Arvo, right, stop eyeing us. We're about to get a, a mouthful of smack. Take a look at you, kid. Jesus. He could have killed you. What the fuck is wrong with him? You're up. Give me that chili. And he's out back Hungry. trying to get some stupid truck started. Here, you should eat something. You okay? believe he's gone I've lost people before but it just hasn't felt this this shitty in a while he cared about you too Jane I know he did no oh, man Luke god damn it that sucks I, I, but I don't think he's dead unless he's unless you see them die he just got pulled down he could have got up Well, I'm glad you did. I'm gonna find something to clean that up. Thank you. Thank you. I can't take this shit anymore. Feeling better? Yeah. Yeah, I guess. Hell of a day. But we gotta get moving. Can't if you're you feeling up to it. I could use a hand out back with this truck. Where are we going? This house ain't worth a crap, but the vehicle's Where are in we bad going? shape. Really? Now? Look, Clem, I know we're all hurting. But I need your help here. Okay? I'll wait for you out back. Jeez, Kenny, where like we can't stay in I'll a place for like more than a, a ten minutes without him saying we have to move, we have to move, we have to move. Dude. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just see what happens, and what happens happens. I, I can't do nothing about it. Clem. <sighs> just be careful. Oh. 
Okay, I think we're about to end the episode very, very soon. Hopefully soon. What did she have to say? I know she was running uh, around. It shouldn't have been our What did she we say? We need to talk about it. Well, we didn't talk about you. Really? Really, Kenny. over but AJ needs us now we gotta stick together on this thing all right I'm all for it I'm sticking come on let's see if the truck's gonna go all right my daddy always had a half dozen wrecks he was fixing up he was a mean some bitch but he taught me respect girl like Jane could learn a thing or two about that. We're all just tired? Yes, we freaking are. We're all tired just and hungry. tired. Hell, I've been tired for two years. All right, give it a turn. All right, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. I'm going to end the video right there. Kenny, everything that just went on, it's, it's emotionally draining. I'm feeling it. It's, it's intense. Um, but yes, thank you so much for watching. Let me know in the comments if you like this episode. And I'll see you in the next one. Episode 3, Part 3. Season finale is going pretty... Pretty... It's covering all the bases. Emotional, action. Um, I just gotta see a twist, that's all. Until next time, everyone. I'll see you then. Peace.